Miss Matema Tupupa, Miss Katinia Louise Labrisa Iomi, who can talk to you about the city of Mali. Who was that man? Who is the man who was Miss Matema Tupupa? For the two hours, you have got this perfume business since I was two years of age. We were staying in Hamilton, and my mother used to push me in the pram while I put the brochure in the mailboxes. In her perfume parties, I helped pass out the catalogs dressed in a theme dress. I was pretty as a doll, and many people bought. Over the years, as I grew older, I was able to do more, such as packing the orders and delivering them to customers' doors. In 2015, my mother decided to move up to Auckland, where there are more customers. She then established a team and called it MMT, Matema Atupa. Their monthly target is 25,000 sales, and twice they won the highest personal sales with a record-breaking amount of 47,000. I play a big part in hitting these huge targets by dancing in their in-house perfume parties and also their online perfume parties. My ability to market their products and advertise through dancing is my greatest talent, which you will witness tonight. On the stage are four perfume sets, which sell the most in their French perfume business. Set number one is Pier One Passion Berry Metal, which is made from passion fruit and cherry blossoms, or in Tonga, the Heilaga. It smells very sweet and romantic, and its value is 200 New Zealand dollars. Oh, 
number three is Pure Seven Honey Blue. It is made from honey and white flowers, or in the islands, the Puadonga. It smells very powerful and beautiful. 200 New Zealand dollars is also its value. <laughs> Blossoms with a touch of marine freshness like the Dui Dui nuts. This set, worn by both women and men, is worth 200 New Zealand dollars. <laughs> Miss Matematica Miss Cardinia Louisa Brisa.